Hello, Allison. What can I do for you? What are you doing with Cerebro? I've been viewing the astral plane, trying to see what Shadow King has done with Charles. What have you found? Nothing. The astral plane is in a tremendous amount of upheaval. I've never seen anything like it before. So Shadow King really hates Professor X, huh? Shadow King despises Charles with every fiber of his being. Why? Because Shadow King is an insatiable egomaniac. Years ago, he was bested by Charles in a battle on the astral plane, and Shadow King would never let that go unanswered. Do you think the professor will survive? My dear, never, ever count out Charles Xavier. He's a man of amazing strength and fortitude. He survived the impossible more than once. I'm counting on him to do so again. Good luck with Cerebro. Thank you, dear. I'll not rest until Charles is set free. Hey, Pebbles. Long time no see. What have you been doing? All this waiting around gets me a little on edge. Do you think we're partially responsible for all this trouble? What? You mean Magneto being free? Well, yeah. The X-Men could have stopped him at the Arbiter, but we didn't. Kiddo, our number one responsibility is to help people. Mutants and humans alike. Saving lives on the Arbiter was way more important than capturing Magneto. But don't worry, Allison. Magneto will get his in the end. How'd you learn to fight so well, Wolverine? Simple. I'm the best at what I do. See you, Wolverine. See you around, kiddo. We've got an emergency. To the war room on the double. Tensions have finally come to a head. There's been a huge upsurge in sentiments against mutants. Anti-mutant rallies are being held in every major city. And mutant control laws are being discussed by every nation in the world. There have been sporadic outbreaks of violence against mutants, but those are just small trickles from a dam that's about to break. Spit it out, Psyche. What's going on? I just received word that Sentinels have begun openly hunting mutants in New York City. To make matters worse, Gerso's soldiers stormed the sewer tunnels and are attacking the Morlocks. Cyclops, I know we've had our differences with the Morlocks, but we must help them. We will, Storm. I spoke to Healer. He agreed to meet us in the sewers and fill us in on the situation. Scott! Scott, can you hear me? Juggernaut's on a rampage and we can't stop him. We need your help. He won't... Looks like we're going to be putting in some overtime today, X-Men. Let's get moving. <laughs> Jubilee. Quickly! Juggernaut is in the facility and he's trying to kill Forge! You better run, little man! <laughs> Isn't technology a wonderful thing? Ah. X-Men! 
Your little friend Forge can't keep running forever. And when I catch him, I'm gonna pulverize him. You should know better than that. Ain't nobody can stop Juggernaut. Not even the puny X-Men. I'm gonna crush you wimps like paper cups. It's go time! Will do. Combo! No fair! Well, that was certainly exciting. Thanks for the help. Me? I'm fine. I just wish my hands would stop shaking. I've got a special brig that can hold Mr. Unstoppable. Let's drop him in there. Once he wakes up, maybe he'll feel like answering a few questions. You got lucky, Meatball, but you ain't never gonna knock me out again. Ah, oh, get out of my head! I hate what you freaks do to a man's brain! I don't know, okay? I was hired by some anonymous joker. He paid me a big bundle of money to do the job. I was supposed to destroy the Astral Gate. I was chasing Forge because I figured he knew where it was. What? I go through all the trouble of fighting you goody two-shoes and it ain't even here? But I was positive it'd be here. You creeps always have Forge mess with new equipment, right? Ah! I'm gonna get you for this, if it's the last thing I ever do! You X-Men have a habit of arriving in the nick of time. Thanks. What I seem to be doing a lot of lately, putting things back together. No, but it's just as well that he didn't attack the mansion. Whoever it was had to be very wealthy. Juggernaut doesn't come cheap. Maybe. But Magneto has always been a hands-on kind of guy. I can't see him hiring someone to do important work that he could do himself. See you later. Bless your hearts. You saved us again. I'm trying to see if I can help poor Charles. I just received word his health is failing. None at all. I fear the worst for him. He won't last much longer if his mind remains trapped on the astral plane. 
I sincerely believe it's our only chance at saving Charles. He must be freed soon or he'll die. <laughs> Goodbye, my friends. Ah, once again, the X-Men arrived to save the day. We should get you guys pagers. Large and in charge. I went to pieces last time I saw you guys, but I've got myself together now. All of myself. <laughs> yeah. Lying in a tank of energized lip ties is way less exciting than it looks. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah. Like any time we have troubles here on Muir Island. <laughs> Hello, my...